Kevin Thomas and I want to take you into our casket selection room today and what we'll do is we'll look through there and help you pick out the casket that you would like to have for your loved one. I want to supply you with this casket uh, price list first and uh, that way if you have any questions as we go go through there uh, you can you can ask and have the prices of all the caskets on there. So if you'll come this way please. This first casket that I'm going to show you it is a hardwood casket. It is a maple casket, but it's called the Ken Ross uh, <clears throat> Sycamore. It's a beautiful casket. It is a uh, uh, got a high luster polish to it. Uh, they just they put coats of lacquer on it and just keep polishing it to get this this shininess. And it's just it's a beautiful casket. It has a a, a velvet interior. It has a sheer uh, upholstery sewing here on the pillow and also on the overlay. It's got a pleated headboard in it. Uh, very nice casket. It's, uh, it is the most expensive wood casket that we have in our showroom. This ne next casket here is a very affordable casket. It, is a, it has a basket weave uh, crate <coughs> interior. It's an 18-gauge adjustable bed. It has a pleated head, bolt, head uh, panel in it. It has a, this is a brushed uh, finish on the uh, exterior here. What it is, uh, and you'll, you'll see it through several of our caskets. They come in, they brush it with the steel uh, brushes, and then they put lacquer on it and brush it up to the uh, luster that they, they want to have on the casket. Um, very nice casket here. The next two caskets I want to show you. These are the caskets that we make available for our military personnel and also for our first responders. You'll see here that it has a, a, the dark blue interior along with the dark blue, of course, on the outside. Very beautiful. It has a, buttons that are here that you can have if, if for military <clears throat> if you want to switch it over. This will make it plain on the outside with no buttons. Uh, very nice uh, upholstered uh, overlay. Looks uh, real nice on it. This casket here is a poplar casket. It's a wood casket. It is also for our military and for our uh, first responders. This one has a black interior to it. Uh, we also have this same casket that has a, a, a cream colored interior. Uh, both all these uh, the three caskets together they they're just they're great for military personnel and for the first responders this next casket here is a very nice casket it is a it is a barn wood casket this is actual barn wood that's uh, reclaimed it is repurposed cleaned up and it's made specially for these caskets uh, this has a, a cotton interior to it uh, it's a, a, a tailored interior. The uh, outside is just, there's no stain, there's no paint. All it is, it has sealer on it, and that's the way the casket is. When you pick a casket out of our selection room, that's the casket you're going to get. One of the reasons we do this is because of the, uh, the knots or the blemishes that might be on this casket. That might be something that the family is really taken with. So that's why. Uh, we make sure that they get this casket. This here is also a, a poplar casket, uh, the, the wood poplar. Uh, it is a, a high gloss, very shiny uh, casket, very nice uh, casket for a, for a person who, uh, who wants something that's, that's wooden and has a high luster to it. I'll show you this next casket here. It's called the Sterling Silver Rose. Is a very nice casket for uh, for ladies of its more mature age. I want to say uh, it's got sheared uh, interior. The uh, the uh, overlay here is sheared. You'll see that, and uh, up here in the head panel, you see these roses. Well, you don't have to have the roses if you don't want them. We make available uh, this plain headboard, a uh, head panel that will go in there and replace that. 
This is an 18 gauge. It is a, a, a sealed casket. You can see it. It's got gaskets around it. It is sealed to keep the elements out once it goes into the grave. Very nice casket. This ne next casket <clears throat> is called a masterpiece. It is our most expensive uh, metal casket that we carry in our selection room. It has the, uh, the brushed uh, exterior finish on the shell. It's not as high luster as some of the rest of them are. It has this uh, velvet tough uh, upholstery on the inside. You see it's in the head panel, the pillow, and the overlay. Very nice. Eight, uh, 16 gauge, this is a 16 gauge. Uh, it's a, a heavier, thicker metal. It's a, a, of course more durable than the 18 gauge. Of course, uh, the, the, this casket is very nice and that's why it, it, uh, it has the, the uh, higher price to it. The rounded corners make it such a, such a nice selection on these, these caskets. This casket here is a, a 18 gauge, as well as this one's 18 gauge. Uh, all of our caskets are 18 gauge, except for, for this one, and then one here in a minute that I will show you, that's a 16. They all have adjustable beds. They are gasketed, so they can be sealed. This here has a basket weave, uh, upholstery on the inside, pleated headboard, uh, excuse me, pleated head panel, very nice. It is. It still has that brushed uh, uh, finish on the outside. It is polished to a uh, more of a luster than what the masterpiece is. But very nice casket at affordable price. This casket here that I want to show you is a. Uh, it's one of our least expensive caskets. It is a metal casket. It's a 20 gauge. It is very thin uh, metal. It's lightweight. Uh, it has a, uh, uh, the crepe interior to it. It's just a plain tailored interior. Uh, it does not have an adjustable bed inside. Uh, the loved one will fit inside here. It's the same interior uh, dimensions as the other ones. Uh, it's the, the other caskets that we provide. Uh, <clears throat> uh, we will, uh, a, a, if we have to make any adjustments to the uh, to the deceased that's in there, we have materials that we have uh, supplied to us that we can put underneath and build them up, uh, and they will look good in this casket. It is a, a nice, affordable casket. It's got a hammer tech hammer tech finish to it. It's a rough finish uh, to it, but it is it's a good casket. It's, it does not seal. Uh, like our other caskets do. We'll now go into the selection room, discuss a little bit more, and if there's more caskets that you'd like to see, we have a, a virtual catalog that we'll look at.